is Matt Gray of the 2021 2022 Bet King Ethiopian Premier League. And the outsider, Mingret Murgeta, St. George on Summit, come here looking for their seventh win in a row. The horsemen have possibly been handed an opportunity to make a 15th mark on Ethiopia's top division. It's a return ball from Ayasu Kamiru, closely tracked, and Eno Carpetro having an opportunity to bring one in, and another chance coming his way to Bay gets the hand, and oh wow. So the Dali with possession, St. George in and around their own area, it was almost picked up by the blue wall, and Bay gets the hand, will take that as a half chance. Absolutely, the uncompatibility un un of the back four, Minyote Bebe just failing to clear. Again, look at the number of players closing Bay gets the hand down, three to pick side. And that's a lot of pressure for a striker. Now oh, it's beginning away to buy again the head through the centre, looking for a chance of Minot de Bebe. Oh, lucky St. George. Very, very lucky. Minot de Bebe, what on earth was he doing? Well, I guess I had tried to get it first. Uh, Charles Lukwago, and he did not get a, a return ball and body through the centre. Last in concentration. Dangerous at this stage, at this level in the league. Well, we've already talked about it, Andrew, that uh, there is a lot of complacency at the back between Prim from Mensa and Mignote Bebe. They are not very, very comfortable on the ball. Aberia Leo is looking to rush into the area and striking that with Venom. If they could have uh, been tucked in on the return ball by Ismail Oro Agoro. Big thanks to Mr. Ayano. That was a huge save. The third man running right behind Arvito and on target with a good shot, they must tank Kale Bubchet because of his good recovery. This is Eno Cardonia looking for Aberia Leo. Controls it and tries to get it past the goalkeeper. And suddenly couldn't convert. Those are two chances to Aberia Leo in two minutes. St. George should be 2 0 up. Oh, those are solid passes. Cardonia just picks that run. That run is fantastic. Just goes around Arpicho. And surely, had he just been calm enough, Abelia Leo should be scoring his fourth goal. They have 54% of the possession, and that's why the battle let's fly. And a big save from Charles Lukwago, punching it away. They got an international to keep St. George in this game. It's too easy. Just St. George keeping Alibachu at bay. That is about 35 yards. It's good side from Charles Lukwago. You can see the ball coming. Again, good goalkeeping determines that if you can't hold on to the ball, just push it out. Will push you away. It's an early chance that is coming straight in. So far, go. Who's there? Who's there? So shots from Miguel Jesus. Could have done better than that or tried to make the Ghanaian shot stop or work a bit more than that. The situation here is four against two, four against three. He should have picked it. One of the players were just coming in and that, that should be Abdam Mutedese. He was just lacking in and around the box. And Okadunya. Looking one forward, looking for Suleiman Hemide. Does well to find Amanyo Gabri Mikal, bring one into the area. Looking for Terry Nesgupsa. He was an extra man and watched. Uh, the second half substitute should have done better than that. He should have. He should have again. Look at that diagonal pass right behind our feature. Call it to control from Hemide. Again, the ball comes into Emmanuel. This time, it's just poor connection. I think lack of expectation from Terry Nesgupsa. He should have taken his time. This has been given away to Cherry Nesgutsa. Now Eno Katonia brings the cross into the area. That will be very easily picked up by Messiah Yano. Oh, suddenly been the beast here of the two goalkeepers here. You've got to keep doing that and keep bringing even better crosses into the box. That, that's what I'm talking about, the third man running. That third man running is going to be very, very vital. Yes, Looking for Emmanuel Gabriel Mikhail. This is Laboro at the edge of the area. Uh, Talk about his striker, put himself with the ball, but then a forest of blue legs right ahead of him, but he simply could not convert. This is suddenly the biggest chance that St. George have had here in the second half. Emmanuel Gabriel Mikhail approaching one into the area. Crucial touch coming off the Sayayano, the goalkeeper. Pressure in this game, he's suddenly going up. Again, that quality delivery by Emmanuel. And you must thank me, say, Ayano, because he put his hands on that ball and just change the direction of the ball. That is quality goalkeeping. Into the center. Now, here's a chance for Alaza to hide a Sharifa who was waiting for him. Uh, didn't get the ball. It eventually fell to Amano Gabriel Mikhail. And uh, the winger simply could not have this one past Messiah Ayano. Quality defending by Berhano Bekele. Quality run there by Yanta Alaza somewhere who's just come on board. Thank you very much for joining us. We do hope you have enjoyed the game. It has lacked the goals, but suddenly has had the action. 0-0 between St.